like, comment, share, subscribe. It do he different when sure cap doing another reaction video, yo, still broski. Because I see it in my shit again. I'm a subscriber. You feel me? I fucks with it. You feel me? I fucks with it. Even though you was complaining about working your ass off, but who ain't gonna complain? I'll be complaining if I was working three jobs. You guys changed my life. And I want to show y'all something. I had this boy for a little minute. I looked at this every day. Still do. People Still comment. Discipline. Hey, tonight I'm going to comment back on everybody's stuff. I just be so busy. I don't even have a chance to like, like I'll go viral every now and then and don't even comment back to the, the comments. I apologize to everybody that I do that to, but this is why niggas like him really ain't got enough time to really just edit or do nothing. Like his shit is so plain. But it's like this is he blew up like you know he got his hundred thousand off this one. If even if it stop at sixty thousand views and it just like slowly never really go up, the nigga already you know he did what he need to do. He monetized now it's it's up from here. No matter what grind, putting money up. My goal is to get a new car. Uh, car two door. He want a two door car. Start that Challenger RT thirty k. Camaro LT 30k payments, gas insurance. Ooh, yeah, you got to focus on that box right there. That box right there, nigga. Hey, hold on. This nigga said one annual single month, one audio single month, one visual month. Uh, every three to four months, every six months. Uh, three, four years. Um, it's a lot of shit. Business and run these channels. Car channel. Bro, go make a car channel when he gets his whip. Get him monetized. Let's talk. Thank you. YouTube. You look like that one dreadhead, uh, one dude that that did that disappearing uh thing. If y'all remember what I'm talking about, the little disappearing dude. Like the nigga disappeared and it was like some weird shit. You kind of that look. changed my life. Being a new YouTuber has changed my life. Hey, hey, bro, I think I'm coming up on my one month anniversary. Well, nah, YouTube. I fuck around been doing YouTube damn near a year and a half now. But I'm coming on my one year anniversary of doing interviews, and that's gonna be in October. Crazy how how them came so far. Wow. I don't even know how to thank y'all. Um, <laughs> I'm sitting here lost for words because I remember the day I started this channel and I was just creating. Mm -hmm. this, is just, this is just a passion that I have is to just create same in a way gang I'm just used to clout bro I'm addicted to clout bro not really like addicted to clout because that's weird to try to say like you're addicted to clout but I've always been popular and I know how to keep my like I understand motion can stop at any moment um, outside of that being said you better keep dropping boy Better keep dropping. Even if you get nigga six hundred views every video you drop, nigga, you better continue. Cause you ain't when is the next time you gonna blow up like that? That shit is not hard, but it ain't easy. Content creation. I'm a I'm an artist, producer. An artist is crazy. You look like uh Kurt, uh Cardell. Not Cardell, no, I'm talking about my nigga C Dilly. Well y'all know what I'm talking about. That one dude, the YBN, YBN Car Car and I just feel like this is what I was born to do. I'm a Leo at that. Leos are hustlers. It do hit different when I was about to talk about Leo season earlier and I was about to be like, you know, I'm just the number one Leo out of this motherfucker. <laughs> I feel like Leos all got an ego. And it's like hard to like have a bigger ego than shirt cap. It's crazy. Especially now that I'm lit as fuck. Like, who fucking more lit than me, bro? I don't give a fuck. Like, the underground... I got underground on lock, man. Get money, people, and they're very creative. 
what's crazy is like i'm a get money nigga, but i really i just always since a kid i used to be like i hate money money's evil because i everything that I've, I've cried over money i you feel what i'm saying like crazy all of these things i've always been good at whether it's music painting drawing um content creation i guess you could say now too like for me a thousand subscribers may not seem a lot to y'all but for me coming where i come from where it's crazy out here and people dying at young ages you know and trying to make a way without being another statistic you trying to find a different avenue to be greater better yourself this is crazy for me um Hey, what's crazy is like on some real ass shit, bro. I don't know if because a lot of people in the town be on some fan shit when it comes to me. So me doing my reaction video to you, bro. If you like low key, not necessarily look up to me, or whenever you like watch different content creators, like bro, like you know what does it take, bro? It takes what you're doing right now, bro. You doing everything right, even if you're doing YouTube twenty four seven or working your ass off twenty four seven. Regardless, you're on. 10 and if you wanted to save for your straight and like just slowly drop you blew up god god working for you god was like hey nigga let me get you viral real quick bro because your ass working your ass off you know that was god right there but you got to put in effort you got to know how to manage bubble i don't know how many more videos you're gonna have after this besides just appreciation of going viral type shit and I know it's some someone out there that's inspiring to be a content creator. I'm going to tell you, it's hard. But like I told y'all a couple videos ago, you just got to enjoy the journey. Don't focus. A lot of people lose focus because they focus on the money. That part, right? That's why I'm not overworking my ass. I'm like, I'm, I'm just like hoping I, I'm barely getting by putting my all into this uh, social media shit and then hopefully I'll just hit that one video on TikTok or something and just get a million views. Not saying a million views will change my life, but shit. I'll take that thousand dollars. And then the motion after that, if I get 200 a month or three, 400 a month, okay, thank you. I need that. I need that. Yeah. I'm saving it. It do hit different. All, all it is worry about that grind if this is something that you want to do stay focused with the journey and be consistent now you don't need much to do this man i i got 160,000 followers on instagram off of an iphone 7 on kelly with the button still like I'm about to get up and show y'all the fucking phone. I ain't even gonna do no game. We ain't even gonna do no game, bro. Let me show y'all, bro. There's no excuses. It is no excuses, bro. Look at the phone that I got, bro. Look at the phone I got, bro. Do y'all see that, bro? Look at the computer I got. I don't even got a real computer. Look at this shit. I had to get the camera, connect the camera, and do it different. It definitely do he different. I'm just seeing, bro. Use what you got. I ain't gonna say even if you got an Android, because that hit different. But right, you need an iPhone. I ain't gonna cap. It could be an iPhone too, nigga. Just don't have no fucking Android. I started this channel just by using an iPhone. I still am. I have a whole camera that I can use, but I grinded, still grinding off the iPhone. And it's not even something crazy. It's like a i it's an iPhone 8 plus. You could literally do anything you set your mind to. This is crazy. Hey, what's crazy is, bro, really that happy. That's how it be. I didn't have videos like this, too. They're just like, bro, like, whoever's there listed to me, I hope y'all understand. You don't need much. But my videos... I didn't expect to resonate with so many people. 
I wasn't expecting all of this to happen. I started YouTube to document just like as a journal because I journal and really what the journals are like is just basically my thoughts, other people's intrusive thoughts and just my outlook on life and just taking it step by step. And there's a lot of like minded people like me out there that resonate with me. <coughs> That's what's getting me. That's what shocks me. So many of you guys are in the same situation or going through the same type of things. And I wanna make these videos to motivate you because a lot of people don't have that in their life. A lot of people don't have families. A lot of their families are gone and they're by themselves. Um, or just having a mentor. Not saying I'm a mentor, but just having somebody that's gonna push them. Facts. I feel you, bro. Everything I've ever did in life, bro, like, I'm going to have to make my own video because I'll be talking you know, up. On them days when they feel like giving up, you know, mm -hmm. feeling like, man, I'm doing all this work for nothing. Nah, you're never doing work for nothing. You should never be doing work and grinding for nothing. You should always be having a goal in mind and a destination. I told y'all that. And if I gotta be the person to motivate y'all, I'ma do it every time. I don't know if people gonna rock with your calmness, bro, but you gotta get more like, ah! You gotta be ready to scream. When you watch Mr. Beast, what is the number one thing you do whenever you watch that video? You go turn that bitch down, damn near low key, huh? It do hit different. You gotta kind of take from the biggest content creators and learn that sound and delivery and different shit like yeah you 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 went viral but it's time to keep going viral i really think For real things are doing so well because i'm just being me like i'm not following a wave i'm not following a trend it's just the camera and me just being real and Sometimes I just need, need these one-on-one -on -one talks just to get back realigned with myself, you know. Um, <coughs> and sometimes you need that. You need that sometimes because sometimes you fall off the bandwagon, you know. Uh. Yeah, man. Good shit, bro. Keep dropping. I'll fuck around and do a reaction video down there every time you do it. Cause I want to see your journey, bro. Like if you go blow up, it would be nice to see somebody blow up on some shit. I like watching people blow up. And after they blow up, I halfway stop watching them. That's why I kind of like, I'm like, damn, I'm about to blow up. Like I'm blowing up. Like, have I blew up and reached my peak to where people are like, oh. That's why I was like, you gotta start doing new shit. You gotta start. You know, you got to really pop out. You got to be, you know, you got to be something, bro. It's got to be something different for real, for real about you in this industry. And I'm not really the same. I do give the same energy a little bit, but not really, though. This is my energy. These niggas are fortunate. I ain't going to cap my shit real. I, I got ADHD. I, I've always, like, without weed, I've, like, nigga, whenever I get sleepy, I laugh. Like, I make jokes, and I force myself to stay up. It's like, uh, I'm damn near high already. But, yeah, man, like, comment, share, subscribe. And, Bob, you got to end your video like that, too. Let niggas know they need to subscribe, bro. It's just bad. Fuck it. It ain't even.